Hey y'all, it's your girl Brittany City and welcome back for day three of Vlogmas. Oh my gosh, already going by getting in the groove of things. Um, today's video is going to be all about what is in my bag tech edition so like looking through some of my older videos especially since i'm getting back in the swing of youtube i've realized that my what's in my bag video so i have a what's in my everyday bag which i still carry that bag a lot i'm going to link that up here and i also have a what's in my travel bag and i'm going to link that up here um both of those videos are like really really highly watched um a lot of people check them out and i can see why like i love what's in my bag videos me personally that's why i did them um and i actually don't have a full vlog for today because i've been a little under the weather and so i thought i'll just come hang with y'all for a minute and show y'all what i have in my tech bag um and i actually also have on my glasses today which i never wear these glasses um one i probably should change out my contacts and i've been like having really watery eyes and sneezing and stuff i think i have like a common cold um and also i thought this red just popped so much with this red sweater my red nails and like just in the whole festive holiday feelings um i thought it was really cute but yes i will link all this stuff down below if you're interested in purchasing these glasses or this sweater or anything um so my current, I would say, tech bag, this has been like my travel bag, this has been everything, this Marc Jacobs tote bag. Love, love, love this bag so much. It is so just like, it's so helpful, so everything. I do need to actually get it in black, maybe, after we see what I um, have over here. Maybe you won't need the black one but um in this color it does get very dirty and um i do work from home um, because of covid and i'm pretty sure we're going to go back to maybe doing one day a week in the office eventually um so you would wonder like why do you have a tech bag like you have a home office why do you need that y'all i literally like every day i try not to and then I, it's just a habit and like that's my like groove I do a lot of my work work at my desk here and then when I um, I even teach from my desk in my office but when I work on personal things whether it's personal projects checking my personal emails um, kind of doing like my planning prepping for YouTube even doing my editing for YouTube typically even though I have this monitor that I probably should really utilize more um, I do kind of pack a lot of my things up and head up to the bedroom and i finish my night um and do some things that i need to do for myself on my computer and with my technology um i like to do it from my bed i guess because it just i've been at my desk all day um and so having a bag is actually still very helpful for me um so i actually have all of my stuff in this bag because this is around the time at night where I would be heading up with my things. Um, but I actually have an unboxing. So if you follow me on Instagram, I was talking about the Rejoy line. I actually have like one of my first, first YouTube videos I did on this line by Saint Laurent. The Rejoy line is like a lifestyle brand. They have lighters, matches. I have like a thermos. I have a mouse pad. And um, these are actually tote bags. I bought two of them because I'm like super impulsive. Um, and I did think they would be a great gift. And so that's why I mentioned it on Instagram because I think they would be a great luxury designer gift under a hundred dollars so this tote was priced at sixty dollars sixty nine dollars i want to say um and i love the packaging i mean i just love saint laurent packaging so cute so sleek and um i thought one of them would be a great gift to give out i can't even think of to who right now but um a gift for Christmas or for birthdays or anything, that line actually sells out very quickly. Oh my. When I um, purchased the other items from the previous video, this was sold out. So when I saw it was in stock, I was like, ooh, I need it. So you see, love the packaging love the packaging. And so um, if you're familiar with St. Laurent, they have the Reeve Gauche. I don't speak French 
um they have that toe that's a very popular toe that you see people carrying it um it's very similar to this mark jacobs toe it's very large in size it's canvas has a huge reeve gauche on it um i can't remember exactly which means which but reeve go or gauche or whatever i think it might be go um means like either river I think they're like river north river south something like that like two different banks like how new orleans has like the east bank the west bank that's how i think of it and, and that's in paris and so this is the tote bag oh my goodness so this one says rejoy like the line the lifestyle line and that's just a different type of direction of the river but i'm getting off that tangent this is so cute this is the tote bag and you can see the rejoice on it it actually has saint laurent lower on the bag and it's a decent sized tote bag i think comparing that with the size of the mark jacobs you can kind of see um it does give you kind of a shopper vibe so kind of um gucci gives it in their bags for free like when you purchase something they actually could do that <laughs> um i don't Saint Laurent is very generous in giving dust bags, but I think something like this would be nice to have when you purchase a handbag. Um, so it's a little thinner, but we're going to be able to just see. I'm going to show the different tech items that I carry with me in my bag, and I'm going to try to load them in here and see if this can work as a new um, what's in my tech bag. So first off, I have to have my laptop. I have a MacBook Pro 13 inch and I purchased this actually at the beginning of the year. Um, and I love it. I've thought about getting the 14 inch, but it doesn't have the trackpad. So don't know if I'm really going to trade off for that yet. But you can see if it's in there, great. It is kind of weighing down and I would um because this bag is thinner i probably would have a case on my laptop if i was really carrying this out like outside of the house um i probably would have some type of extra security because if it bumps i mean it's going to get all of that impact next up is my ipad and ipad pencil um so i got this ipad this year as well i've had like a number of ipads like i don't even want to tell y'all how many and i just never really use them but i will say this is the ipad air 4 um it looks very similar to the ipad pro like the smaller size ipad pro i personally just chose to um not get the ipad Pro, I feel that I've already had all these iPads before and I rarely use them, but I will say that I have actually used this so much more than I've ever used an iPad. And I had a pencil with my last one too, um, but I think I've just really gotten into the groove and like found a way for it to really work with my um, lifestyle, with my planning. Let me know if y'all would be interested in any um, video on just like some of my favorite ways that I use this iPad or how I use my Apple products and how I sync them together because that's like my favorite thing about apple that's how everything syncs so ipad goes in there great next up let's throw in the chargers so this is the computer charger this is the ipad and my cell phone and let's throw in my cell phone this is a iphone throw 13 pro max love 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 this phone i'm a sucker for iphones and um i can't even tell you like so many people ask like what's the major differences i came from an iphone 11 so this 13 to me the camera alone was like a difference and i mean i take pictures and i'm like oh my gosh this camera is so good um but everything else probably the same so this is with iphone ipad macbook and my chargers and it's getting a little heavy but we're still good i feel like we're still good and so um i also carry a external hard drive this is where i keep all of my videos and my coding so like my um code notebooks 
um i keep i keep everything on here actually i um even though i have a terabyte on my macbook i keep slides from classes that i teach i keep my different like i said my coding my code projects data projects and data so like data is so much space alone so um i keep it all on here and i got this from amazon i'll link everything um below from amazon i also carry hmm, let's see oh so because i have the i because i have the macbook 13 from previous in this year um of course you know we don't have any ports they just brought the ports back which is the reason why i'm trying to decide if i should get the new macbook um but this is crucial 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 um and what i love about this one so many people have these little doohickeys um for their different ports but oftentimes they have like a cord going between them um between this and the macbook and i don't like that like i like this because it just flushes right to the macbook and it's just all seamless and i love that um especially since my external hard drive has its own cord that would be like a lot of cords and things going on that would be weird so throw that in there we're going good like this is gonna be my bag i love it um this is my vlogging camera i have a video on um i'm gonna link it up here video on why i love this camera um and since it's vlogmas and um i actually just want to get back in the groove of vlogging period i am carrying my vlogging camera with me more often so i'm gonna throw that in this bag as well and lastly so I actually have two last things, but the main thing is my work phone. So I um looking at stuff on my work phone right now. So this is my work phone. It's just like an older iPhone, but everything is on here. So like my emails, my teams um slack everything is on here and if i'm not by my work computer which oftentimes i'm not um <laughs> then i would like to have this with me so that i can know what's going on and lastly i pulled out this planner because sometimes i do actually oftentimes i have this planner in my larger bag um but i really feel like that's gonna be pushing it and i am actually getting a new planner it comes tomorrow and if you're interested in seeing any kind of content on how i plan my life um, i actually use a paper planner in addition to my ipads planner um digital planner that i have on there so let me know if you're interested in anything like that but this is everything in the bag and I don't even think it's like super heavy i don't feel like i'm nervous that something is gonna be weird or not work out so this is a designer it could be your everyday tote for 60 something dollars like you cannot beat that you cannot beat that so still i'm gonna put it on my arm i show y'all i'm not sure if that makes a difference but so cute so so cute you can see how it is kind of weighing down but i don't think it's terrible i don't think it's terrible so that is everything for vlogmas day three y'all i just wanted to show y'all this bag i feel like every day i'm gonna be unboxing something um because i've ordered just like a whole lot of stuff um so I want y'all to make sure that you click that subscribe button notification bell so you're alerted whenever i upload my next videos for vlogmas and for just everything to come after and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this content thank y'all so much bye